This is Colin Benson welcoming you to Highbury for one of the big occasions of the season, the clash with Chelsea. And what a night it promises to be, with Arsenal not only looking to extend their record to 12 straight wins, but also hoping to go back to the top of the first division table. Yes, that's exactly what they'll do if they win tonight. George Graham is able to announce an unchanged side for the sixth successive game. The only doubt was Tony Adams, who damaged his ribs in the 1-0 win at Newcastle last Saturday, but he passed the test before the match. Alan Smith scored the all-important goal in the very last minute to make it two goals in two games, and that takes his total to the eight for this season. There's a man with plenty of goals too. The fullback for Arsenal. He's uh, the penalty taker as well, Michael Thomas. And number 11 there, Kevin Richardson. Doing a few stretching exercises. He's now establishing himself on the left of midfield. Having a little chat there with the mascot, eight-year-old Scott Foster, who comes from New Southgate. Very diminutive little figure out there with the ball. Number four, of course, Steve Williams. It's really a regular lineup this for the Arsenal's. One of the most consistent sides in the country at the moment. Well, it's six years since Chelsea last won here at Highbury and their chances of ending this barren run haven't been enhanced tonight. They've had a cruel crop of injuries. Goalkeeper Eddie Need Whiskey is the latest and he twisted his knee in their 1-0 win over Oxford last Saturday and is replaced this evening by Roger Freestone, a very inexperienced young player who last made an appearance in the first team in the last game of last season. Well, Chelsea are also without Kerry Dixon, Mickey Hazard and John Bumstead and Steve Wicks, two long-term casualties. Manager John Hollins also makes one and force change. He's brought in John Cody, a midfield player, in place of Kevin Wilson. Cody will wear the number nine shirt. And uh, the man he's replaced is Kevin Wilson, a striker, so it suggests that maybe he's looking to shore up a defence which has conceded 14 goals in their last seven away games. Well, it's obviously Arsenal who are going to kick off. The referee this evening is George Tyson from Sunderland. The linesman with the red trim on his flag is Mr J.R. Harris. And the linesman with the all-yellow flag, Mr A.P. Murphy. Richardson trying to get Perry Groves away. Joe McLaughlin, the Chelsea skipper. Nice early touch there for Roger Freestone. He's got a, a beautiful physique for a goalkeeper. Very talented young player indeed. Must be quite a nerve-wracking experience for him this evening, though. This is uh, one of the big games of the season. Clark getting that one forward for Chelsea. But what a record Arsenal is setting. Uh, they've already broken the club record for the number of straight wins. They're looking to extend that figure to 12 tonight as David O'Leary gets that ball forward. Well taken by Smith. Davis. O'Leary to Kenny Sansom. Richardson. Richardson uh, tumbled over there by Clark. Dorigo now. Adams there. Gordon Jury. Now he's a man with lots of pace. And he's uh, trying to get past Adams. He's brought down. It's a free kick to Chelsea. Just five yards to the left of the penalty box. And a uh, jury's place there. Sorting Adams out. So a free kick to Chelsea. Just one and a half minutes of the game gone. Pat Nevin, the uh, sorcerer, will take it. Lifts it high to the far post, looking for McLaughlin. McLaughlin got the touch, and it's a goal kick. Well, he lifted it a little too high. Big Joe McLaughlin there. Always dangerous in the air. 
has one big ambition, and that's to lead uh, Chelsea to a championship triumph. They've only ever won the league title once in the whole history of the club. Nice touch by Smith. Pates is there. Long one from Feastone. Wegley couldn't get hold of it. Adams. O'Leary. Michael Thomas. Trying to get Paddy Groves away. Pates was up for it. Clive Wilson's there, got a touch to Pat Nevin. But uh, good tracking back there by David Rowcastle. And Rowcastle said sprawling. Free kick is uh, Chelsea's. Nobody wants to uh, give the ball back. Dorigo with the free kick. England under 21 international. One of the most promising left backs in the country. Davis. Oh, he took an elbow from Darren Wood then, but uh, the referee takes no action. Adams. Lukic. Massive kick from John Lukic. Smith. Darren Wood hooks it away. Jury with the touch. Adams. Trying to get Perry Groves away. Pates is there. Long ball from Pates. Swallowed up by O'Leary. Smith, a beautiful ball through for Rocastle. Rocastle's going through. Richardson's there. He must score. He does. It's a goal. Seconds. Arsenal take the lead. Well, what a marvelous ball that was through for Rocastle. Rocastle made the best use possible. He drew the player, drew the defender, slipped it inside to Richardson, who had the simplest of tasks to side foot it into the net. So, four and a half minutes gone, it's Arsenal one, Chelsea nil. Pates. Thomas with the header. Cody. Good one for Wegley. Wegley with Adams. Adams got the uh, touch to the ball, knocked it over the line for a corner. Good defensive play that from Tony Adams. So, a corner to Chelsea, which Wegley will take himself. Short to Nevin. Wegley's cross. Davis. Nice control by Davis. Sanson. Long one from Lukic. Smith got a touch. Richardson. That's offside. Flag was up. Whistle's gone. It's offside. Some instructions there from David Rocastle. Freestone with the kick. Jury got the touch. O'Leary gets the clearance in. McLaughlin. Adams, intercepted there by Darren Wood to Pat Nevin, back on his normal right side now, Nevin with a flick through, the flag's up on the far side, it wasn't uh, Wegley who was offside, it was Jury way over on the left there, Sansom, long one from Lukic, Jury getting past O'Leary, being held by O'Leary. It's a free kick to Chelsea. Cody, the man in the picture there with the number nine on his shirt. 
Clive Wilson takes the kick though. Again, lofted very high, but uh, the referee wants it taken again. As Clive Wilson prepares to take the kick a second time. This time Cody gets the cross in. Sanson heads it away. Darren Wood. Beaten in the air by Davis there. Wood again. Beautiful ball over the top. Pat Nevins there. He, can he score? Great work, but he has scored! I was going to say, great work by Lou Kick. It seemed he'd got it, but Nevins scores. For Chelsea, ten minutes gone. It's Arsenal one, Chelsea one. And Pat Nevin gets his fourth goal of the season and his second goal in successive games. Well, really, that's what the crowd have come to see. Goals. An exciting start to this local derby then. It's one goal each. John Cody lifting it over the top for Jury. Jury rolls it back to Clive Wilson. Clive Wilson in the box to Wegley. Wegley dispossessed there by Davis. Good work by Davis. Very cool. Oh, has he given it to Nevin? He has. Nevin shoots wide. Well, full marks to Lukic there because Pat Nevin was in. He tried to scoop the ball into the net, but the goalkeeper was there in front of him. He spread himself and really gave him very little target to aim at. So, Arsenal can thank their goalkeeper for keeping them on level terms. Well, what a start. Just 12 minutes gone. And already, it could be two goals each. But it isn't. It's one goal each. And a really exciting match. Richardson and Clark having a, a little tussle there. And... Uh, the referee, no, he's waving play on. I thought he was going to have a little word there. He hasn't blown his whistle. Keeping the game flowing. Pates with the header. Wegerly to Clive Wilson, to Nevin. Nevin trying to get past Sanson. Sanson showing all his experience there. He's got Richardson on the left. Richardson knocks it into space, but uh, Groves has got no chance of getting that one. On Freestone... Uh, taking no chances so a throw to Arsenal Smith Smith blocked by McLaughlin but wins the corner Steve Williams. Short one and uh, cut out by Jury. He only uh, skied it though. For Davis. Shielding the ball magnificently there. Finds Adams. Adams knocks it over back to Davis. Sansom's there with the flags up. Oh, that was that was unlucky because that really was a delightful. Delightfully constructed move, that. It's McLaughlin, he's going through, Freestone comes out, he slipped it in, Pates is there, he saved it! Well, a quick burst there from Arsenal. And McLaughlin was left stranded as Groves burst past him. Groves tried to tickle the ball in, but uh, Pates managed to get back and just scooped it away for a corner. Williams with the corner. Freestone. Nice clean catch, that. That'll give him confidence. Well, you couldn't wish for a better opening 15 minutes to this game. It really has been end-to-end -end stuff with opportunities at both ends over the top again for Groves McLaughlin wins this one Dorigo Davis 
Pates. Oh, a loose one to Richardson. Can he get a second goal? He can! Oh, a magnificent second goal by Kevin Richardson. 16 minutes gone. It's Arsenal 2, Chelsea 1. Well, it was a gift, wasn't it, from uh, Colin Pates. We'll have a look at it from the camera behind the goal. And uh, Pates obviously didn't realise Richardson was there. But uh, Richardson is faster uh, becoming or building a reputation as a goal scorer now. That's his uh, fourth goal of the season. And it's uh, four goals in uh, the last four games as well. Rocastle trying to worm his way through. Helped out by Davis. Thomas. Looking for Smith. Smith got the nod. There's the shot from Williams. Oh, that was only, what, six, eight inches above the bar. through Thomas misses it jury goes on another run Adams is there will be another corner so once more jury's pace opening up the Arsenal defense well Lukic obviously thought it was a goal kick but uh, the referee is quite uh, firm about it Roy Wegley then with the corner kick Smith won that one Davis not out. Wilson's there. Yes, it is. It's a corner. The referee was right on the line. He reckoned the ball was over. So Clive Wilson with this corner. Headed cleanly away there by O'Leary. Wilson again. Stopped by Williams. Picked up by Nevin. Nevin tries to get the cross in. Well fielded there by John Lukic. Rocastle, backfield Thomas, O'Leary, Sanson, Richardson's on the left, goes for the long one, trying to get into the space behind the blue back line which has moved up in unison to work the offside trap. Arsenal trying to play balls into that space behind and hope that the front runners are quick enough to get onto it. Clive Wilson, didn't get hold of that one. Rodrigo getting that ball forward. Rocastle now, up against Cody. Cody gets the challenge in. Michael Thomas. I'm not sure whether the referee is telling him to uh, do it quicker or telling him to stop uh, inching forward. Rocastle, a beautiful turn by Rocastle. Steals the dummy, but Clive Wilson was back there to dispossess him. Free kick given to Arsenal, though. Just five yards away from the corner of the penalty box. Rocastle's also there. Oh, it's Rocastle that gets it across. Oh, and a header there from Groves. Just past the post. Well, that was a good effort. Yes, it shaved his uh, shortcut hair there. 
gave this man a fright, that's for sure. Ooh, beat both uh, Wegley and O'Leary. There's uh, quite a bit of wind blowing around the stadium here. Pates won that one. Richardson, Davis. Nicely, yes, he's got past McLaughlin, but uh, in doing so, he had to scoot the ball forward. Won the free kick, though. So this is a striking position for Arsenal. Just about eight yards outside the penalty box. And a good angle for a shot, I would think. Smith trying to... Uh, Move the Chelsea defence like a, an American quarterback. Adams. Richardson. Well, he kept it in this uh, side, but uh, it went over the goal line. Goal kick to Chelsea. Fury with the flick, Adams is there. Smith. Smith trying to get uh, Richardson away. Davis, Sanson, Richardson. Richardson and Clark, Sanson. Adams. Plays it in space, I think it'll twirl out though. Adams uh, didn't intend it to go there, obviously. Explaining where it should have gone. Clark for the throw. Sanson with the header. Pat Nevin. Clive Wilson taken on by Wegley. Wegley runs into trouble. Davis now. Davis holding it. Good play, that. A lovely ball from Adams over the top for Rowcastle. He's got Smith and uh, Groves inside, and also Davis now. Turns Clark easily enough. There's the cross. And there's Smith. He's hit the bar. And hooked away by Pates. Well, beautiful play that by Rocastle. He made the chance. Sent in a perfect cross. Smith got him up of everybody. Turned his head at goalwards. And it struck the crossbar. 33 minutes gone. Throw to Arsenal. Perry Groves with a long one. Headed away there by Pates. Jury now. Quick throw, Adams is there. Well, that's the problem that Chelsea have got because every time they get the ball, there's not one man to beat, there's two or three. The Arsenal players just uh, come back, they cover each other so well. Thomas is cross. Clark. Sansom, Wood, Wegley, Pat Nevin now. Uh, Nevin through to Wegley, the flag's down. Wegley didn't think it was, he looked up. Oh, he's missed a sitter. And Jury was there. Well, I think that was complete inexperience because Wegley was through. He knew he was by himself. He thought he must be offside. He, you, you'll see on the replay. He slows down, he glances up, he's sure he's offside, then he realises he's not, tries a shot and completely makes a hash of it. So, Arsenal breathe again from uh, that experience. Still maintain their lead. Adams. Nevin to Wegerly. Wegley driving on. Will he go this time? Going all the way. Oh, and uh, he ran out of space again. And what's more, he had two men to his left, Cody and Jury. Lachlan. Nevin. 
Sanson beaten by Jury. Clark. Clark going inside. Trying to get it back out to Jury. It's cut out by Will, uh, Richardson. This is gone. Rocastle. Got it round McLaughlin. Rose chasing. McLaughlin got it back to free zone. But uh, he was also fouled in the process as Groves tried to pull him off the ball. Free kick to Chelsea. Dorigo back to Freestone. Wood. Adams. Smith. Throw to Chelsea. Wegley. Clark. Clockland. Throw to Arsenal. Sansom. Short one for uh, O'Leary. Chelsea concede another corner. Rocastle and Groves are just in the D. Bit of movement there now as O'Leary tried to flick that one across. Sansom now. Well, that's got to be handball, <laughs> but he got away with it. He picked it up before the whistle had gone, so uh, really, technically, that was handball. Adams. Richardson over on the far side this time, being fouled by Pates. Free kick to Arsenal. Castle. Good cross from here. Smith's here with a header. Well, another great cross from Rocastle. Smith was there on the end of it. Just uh, couldn't direct the header in the right direction. But uh, this man, who's just picked up the uh, Barclays uh, Eagles Young Player of the Month award. Good again. Davis is trying to uh, get possession. Richardson does. And Pates falls off Groves as though Groves tried to. Uh, Groves is trying to run through the defenders for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> it's much easier if you go around them, Sunshine. So Clark gets the free kick. Jury with the header, Pates, whacked away by O'Leary, Dorigo to Clark. Both the two centre-backs are up in the attack for Chelsea. Sanson, Adams will get this away. Oh, completely miscued it. Well, there it is, the half-time whistle. And uh, Arsenal have shown all the poise and composure you would expect from a team in their lofty position in this first 45 minutes. But Chelsea too have shown quality in their play and have given them more than a scare or two to think about. Well, it was 1-1 when Colin Pate made a drastic error. He gave the ball to Kevin Richardson, who wrapped in his second goal of the match. And that gave Arsenal the lead at the halfway stage.
Leeds, Arsenal 2, Chelsea 1. Well, the whistle's gone, but uh, Chelsea won't take the kick because Williams has come into the circle. Clark. Adams. Well, if the second half's anything like the first was, we're in for another 45 minutes of great football. Rose got past Pates there, but uh, was brought down. Free kick to Arsenal. Terry Groves scored twice this season. Left foot in swinger, headed away by McLaughlin. Richardson. Clive Wilson. McLaughlin. Chelsea's ball. ball from McLaughlin Adams is there Lukic Smith what a beautiful ball to Davis Rose is offside well, the flag was very late in going up. It really was. Uh, the linesman reacting after the ball had been played through. Certainly not when the kick, uh, when the ball was played. Well, he'll be sick about that. But uh, I felt he was fractionally offside when the uh, pass was made. Smith now. Richardson came off Clark. Nevin. Wegley. Wegley can't get through that uh, forest of red shirts. Clive Wilson now. He won that well. Trying to uh, put Wegley away. Wegley hustled out of it by Adams. Wegley, an exciting young player who's uh, gaining in stature. Clockland's header. Throw to Arsenal. Quick one to Thomas. Rowcastle. There's the cross, and it's a good one too. Smith there gets the nod back. The only one that picks it up though is Pates, and he can't keep it in. It's uh, wanted too much room. It's a corner to Arsenal. Smith there with the header back across the goal. But it was a fine ball from Rowcastle again. He's uh, really sent over some brilliant crosses this evening. Paul Davis with the corner kick. Too high for Smith. Flicked away by Darren Wood. Picked up by Williams. Adams. Throw to Chelsea. Sansom, Wood, Williams, Smith, Freestone. Freestone, who made a brilliant save from Smith's header in the first half. And the uh, fans up on the south bank really getting behind uh, Chelsea now as Jury gets the cross in. And it's not a bad cross either. Well taken by John Lukic. And what a good throw out to Rowcastle. Williams, Smith, Rowcastle. Try the first time ball through to get to, to Davis, but cut out by McLaughlin. Cody. Good ball from Cody. Threaded it through to Pat Nevin. Rowcastle's checking back. Nevin got past him. Beautiful little uh, skill there from Nevin. Nevin dancing into the box. Gets the shot in straight to Lukic. 
once more. Jerry was in the middle, waiting for the cross. But Pat Nevin, the Scottish international, showing why he is uh, included in that class of football. Rowcastle getting through on his strength there. Williams, long one, looking for Richardson. It's Arsenal's throw. So the second half hotting up again. After a quiet start for this game, because it really has been a terrific match. Smith, Sansom, Davis, Darren Wood with the challenge. Sansom again. Groves beaten by Pate. Pates again with the clearance, only as far as Davis. There's a shot, oh, just over the bar. Well, Paul Davis, he's uh, got four goals this season. Williams. Back to Michael Thomas. Nice little uh, notch on there by Rocastle. Smith did well. Thomas over the top for Rocastle. Rocastle being uh, hustled there by McLaughlin. And Dorigo uh, <laughs> taking no prisoners. He whacked that straight out. Perry Groves with a throw. And uh, he's got a long one, don't forget. He can easily get that into the six yard box. There it is for Smith. Rocastle shot, blocked. Oh, a good effort there by Michael Thomas. Well, Michael Thomas, as I say, said earlier, he's uh, getting a, a name as a scorer. He's got four goals this season. In fact, that is one of the strengths of this Arsenal team, the all-round goal power, because every one of these outfield players, apart from uh, David O'Leary, has scored this season. Smith, held by McLaughlin, free kick to Arsenal, Steve Williams, quick one, Richardson, there's the cross, well clawed out of the air by Freestone, and a good throw from him to Cody, John Cody, he's got Clive Wilson inside, jury's over at the uh, far side, Nevin now, Nevin trying his luck on the left flank. Oh, Clive Wilson waited for it, Williams didn't, he won the ball. And that's a, a foul by Dorigo, no, uh, no two ways about that. He waited for Williams to come alongside and just uh, went straight into him. Well, Tony Dorigo, who was one of the outstanding England under 21 performers in a tournament in Toulon, in France uh, in the summer, McLaughlin whacked that away. Cody came off the referee. Dorigo. Darren Wood in there. Jury now. Jury with a bit of space. Can he use it? He's got tremendous pace, this fella. Tries a long shot. That's not good enough to attest John Lukic. Well, Gordon Jury is the only uncapped player announced by Scotland for next week's European Championship match. He's uh, got a couple of under-21 caps for Scotland. The last one uh, was a painful experience. He was concussed. Pates, Thomas, Rocastle took it nicely. Rocastle going by himself. Will he have a shot? Oh, gets it to Richardson. Can he get his hat-trick? And uh, it was Clark who saved the day. Because Richardson got the shot in, Clark got the foot, foot across and deflected the ball behind for the corner. We'll have a look at that uh, from the camera behind the goal. Lovely build up this. Rocastle going. He dummies to play it uh, inside, goes himself to the left, then knocks the ball across to Richardson. Oh, it's a goal! A 
deflection and three stones beaten at the near post. One minute's gone, it's Arsenal three, Chelsea one. Well, we'll have to look at the, uh, the replay from behind the goal to see who scored it. I think it was Williams touched it in. It's really uh, a goalkeeping error, that one, because he uh, shouldn't have been beaten on his near post like that. Have to put that one down to inexperience. Long one from Freestone. Adams is there. McLaughlin. Steve Williams. An up and under for Perry Groves. Pates goes over the top. Woods gets a touch. Adams. Cool bit of play by Adams. then to be taken by Clark. Smith. Thomas. Oh, beautiful ball for Perry Groves. Groves shoots it, hits the keeper. A great save by Freestone. Well, he gave uh, Perry Groves nothing to shoot at, used his bulk well, spread himself in front of the Arsenal striker. But a beautiful build-up again from the Gunners. So, Chelsea's ball. Well, they've got an uphill uh, struggle now because 3-1 uh, down against the Gunners at Highbury. There's not many teams could... Uh, well, not anybody around, I should think, at the moment in the league that can come and uh, turn that scoreline upside down here. Because uh, Arsenal, one of the most consistent, one of the best drilled sides in the first division. And of course, this man here, John Lukic, he's behind uh, the meanest defence in the first division. They don't give uh, goals away lightly here. And uh, that own goal by... Roy Wegley has really uh, put Chelsea under a lot of pressure indeed. Rowcastle now. Oh, beautiful slide of foot there. Gets the cross in. Davis. Shot. Oh, and well taken. As uh, Richardson crumples up on the 18-yard line. But didn't he take that well? And Richardson's hurt. Richardson uh, hobbles back into the game. Freestone uh, comes back into goal from a, a walkabout. And the match gets underway with a free kick from David O'Leary. Thomas. Smith trying to get it through. Tony Dorigo uh, getting it safely back to his goalkeeper. Well, everybody's warming up on the far side. Could be that they're cold because it's quite a chilly uh, evening here. This game, of course, brought forward to uh, the Tuesday night from the Saturday because of England's pending uh, international in Yugoslavia. We'll talk about that in a minute as uh, Roe Castle up against Dorigo. Gets the ball across to Thomas. Oh, Thomas went over the top of the ball. That was bad luck. O'Leary's in there. Davis. Richardson. Beautiful little ball. The flag's up. Offside. They just ran through a little too quick. But Arsenal really playing with a lot of confidence. As I was saying, this uh, match has brought, been brought forward to the Tuesday night because of uh, England's vital European Championship match next week in Yugoslavia. They need at uh, least a point from that to qualify for the European finals. 
And uh, Bobby Robson has managed to persuade the Football League to postpone all the league games on Saturday, all the matches, that is, involving uh, teams with his players in. And of course, Arsenal are well represented in that team with uh, skipper Kenny Sansom, Tony Adams, centre-back, and David Rocastle is in the under-21 squad. Free kick to Arsenal, David O'Leary coming up, the only man, don't forget, uh, in the outfield that hasn't scored for Arsenal this season. Can he put that right this evening? Steve Williams with the free kick. Over the far post, headed away by Cody. Jury now. Jury stopped by Sansom. Davis, Sansom with the flying header. Rowcastle fix it on for Perry Gross. Perry Gross gets a shot in. Oh! Got a deflection. Pasted well. And now Perry Gross is in a heap in the Chelsea penalty area. Well, it was a great ball through. He ran on. The goal was in front of him. He let fly, but uh, the deflection there, and uh, all Arsenal get out of that fine move is a corner. And looks like Perry Gross might have a headache as well. Corner then, to be taken by Paul Davis. Three stones there. Taking his time with the clearance. Waiting for the bodies to get forward. Sansom's header. Clark. Nice little uh, back heel there by Darren Wood. Jury to Wegley. Wegley showing some pace here. Wegley to Jury. The flag's up. Won't count. Good save anyway by Lukic. But uh, Gordon Jury was offside. Says the linesman. Free kick to Arsenal. Pates with a header. Richardson. Clark in with the tackle. Sansom. Lachlan. Clark. Jury with a flick on, Wegley, Sansom, Davis, beautiful skills there, took it on his chest, oh and look at that turn, now Rowcastle, Smith, Michael Thomas, Arsenal really playing with uh, poise and purpose now, over the top, oh Smith nearly got in as McLaughlin went down. Well, Alan Smith came racing in there. Clocklin uh, slipped, I think, and uh, the Arsenal centre forward nearly uh, got on the end of that ball. And we have a substitution. It's uh, Roy Wegley who's going to come off. Roy Wegley, who uh, unfortunately put through his own goal to give Arsenal their 3-1 lead. And on comes Kevin Wilson, the striker signed from Ipswich in the summer. And. Uh, he has found it uh, difficult to claim a regular place in the Chelsea attack. 77 minutes gone. Good cross, headed away by Darren Wood. Kevin Wilson with his uh, first touch out to Cody. To Clive Wilson. Kevin Wilson breaking to the left. Clive Wilson to Jury. Jury, oh, he took it lovely. Threads it through to Pat Nevin on the right wing. A good uh, attack developing here, but uh, Nevin doesn't get his cross in. Richardson gets it away. Throw to Chelsea. Wood. Nevin. Clive Wilson. Steve Clark. There's a cross, high one to Jury. Oh no, it's too far. Jury couldn't get it. Dorigo's there. 
can only keep it in for Rocastle. Rocastle bursts forward for Arsenal. Tried a long one, stopped by Clive Wilson. He'll try it again, finds Williams. Richardson. Perry Groves is on the left. Groves takes it. Turns inside, there's the cross. Davis is there with a the header! Oh, and he's just couldn't get over it. Domingo got a touch, and it's a corner to Arsenal. David O'Leary coming up again into the six-yard box. He's the man on the near post. Picked on by O'Leary. There's the header from Smith and uh, another corner from Dorigo. So Davis gets another go. Will he uh, try the same one? O'Leary coming forward for this time. Leaving the space for Perry Groves. Jury's there. That's a real up and under. Throw to Arsenal. And McLaughlin in trouble with the referee again. Well, this really is silly because he's already been uh, booked. Williams. Wood. Jury. McLaughlin. Good play by McLaughlin. Kevin Wilson, Adams is there, Steve Williams. Williams doing the job. Won the ball, keeps possession. Foot up, free kick to Arsenal. taken Sansom with the shot oh he hit it well good strike that from the England fullback just wide of the target though Kenny Sansom who's uh, scored once this season Sansom back to Lukic so controlled Chelsea chasing shadows at this moment. Groves. Clive Wilson. Smith putting Clark under pressure. Free kick to Chelsea. Nevin will take it. McLaughlin's up there for the high one. McLaughlin's there, but Smith wins it in the air. Kevin Wilson got a touch. Richardson hooks it away. Groves. Williams. Clark. Missed kick that one. Davis picks it up. Richardson now. Through for no, Groves, and he wasn't offside that time. He timed his run perfectly. He held his run, he checked it, he looked across and then he went and uh, really one has to say that was a bad decision by the linesman. Kevin Wilson. It's just an automatic reaction as soon as they see a player getting goal side of the defender they just stick their flags up and uh, it does detract from the game a bit because the emphasis is always given to the negative side. Don't gather that. An injury there, I think. Whistle's not gone, it's still playing on. Kevin Wilson to Nevin. Back to Kevin Wilson. Adams still holding his face in the middle of the park. As Clark gets that one across. Lou kick there, as sure as ever.
does header. Davis is there. Long ball. We're into stoppage time now. in the wars again. Oof. Dodgy one from Doriga. So that's it. Uh, Arsenal go back to the top of the first division with this their 12th straight win in a row. A great victory for them. A game full of passion, pride, and no mean skill. Two great goals from Kevin Richardson gave them a 2-1 interval lead. Although Jury and Wegley did show their paces in the first half, but in the second half. Arsenal really took command. They showed their class, tight at the back, masterful in midfield, and quick and inventive up front. In the end, there was only one goal in the second half. It was an own goal from Wegley. That made it 3-1 to Arsenal. It was sufficient to give them the points and take them back, as I say, to the top of the lead, where they go above Liverpool. The final score here then at Highbury, Arsenal 3, Chelsea 1.